Hey, hey guys. guys! Welcome back to CNC Life. And today we have a wonderful vlog for you guys because guess what? Today is. Wait, where is he? Come here. Come where is he? Here. Come here. Come here. Today is Coda's birthday! Coda's birthday! Happy birthday! So, if you guys don't know, Coda is five years old today. And we're going to be. We also have a vlog for you guys today. We're going to be uh, hanging out and doing some stuff today and run some errands. But today is Coda's birthday, so we're here seeing him. Because uh, it shouldn't be too long until we get to take him home because we're going to be moving out of our apartment soon. But anyway, today's Coda's birthday. He's five years old. If you guys don't know, I got Coda when he was eight months old. I rescued him from someone who really didn't like him and really didn't want him. And from then on, he's been my little puppy and now he's pooping. He's pooping. <laughs> yep, he's pooping. That is your puppy right there. That's Look at puppy right there. <laughs> That's my boy. He's a good bowel system. <laughs> Anyways, okay, Carlos, I feel like we should do something for Coda for his birthday, don't you think? I really think we do. He doesn't really have that much toys. I think we should take him out to a, a dog store. Uh, that is like that challenge they've been doing. They've been doing this challenge that's like um, everything buying he everything he touches, no budget challenge. I actually saw Missy and Brian just do it, which uh, it looked like a lot of fun. They did it with Karma, but we can't do that today for Coda. He's pooping again. Dude, oh he's my pooping. No, no, no. Oh, bro, you still got it oh, on your he's butt. Still going, he's still you, going. you still got it on your butt, Coda. He knows. He's so stressed out right now. He's like, who's looking at me? Sorry, we'll quit looking at you. <laughs> you're, you're doing good. Anyways, so we can't do that today because I have a really important doctor appointment tonight, or today actually. It's actually in like like an hour or so, right? And then we're going to head up to Orange County right after her doctor appointment. So we have to do this another day, maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow we'll take Coda on a no budget challenge for his birthday. Yeah. He's a precious boy, huh? And you poop okay? He pooped okay. He's good. Sit. Yeah, you're turning into an old man. When do they become old? When it's old. He wants to go back inside already. He's already he's... old. Look at him. He's a little old man. Coda, he's where's okay. the ball? Go get the ball. He's like, wait, really? <laughs> anyway, oh, you know, he does have a toy. We, we got this for him for Christmas. Yeah, we did. Um, anyways, guys, so I have a really important doctor appointment today because I haven't really talked about it that much maybe, but I have really bad wrist problems. I've had wrist problems for maybe like, jeez, I don't know, maybe like almost 10 years or so. And so I've been having like on and off like really bad pain, but I feel like over the past couple of years it's gotten worse. So I finally, I was finally able to get x-rays done and MRIs done. And I'm finally gonna find out today what is wrong with my wrist. Um, you guys can see here that I got a cortisone shot and it permanently, can they see it? Yeah, you can see the discoloration. The discoloration right here. because I got a cortisone shot on my wrist and hoping to like relieve the pain, but it didn't really work. So we're still, I got my MRI the other day, which was yeah. so hard you to get. You wanna tell them what the insurance did to you? The insurance was like, oh my gosh. I mean, I think everybody has like nightmare insurance problems, right? But like they were, they wanted me to get an MRI so we could like finally know what's wrong. I'm like, I'm so stoked, you know? I'm like, oh yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna find out what's wrong with my wrist. I'm so excited. And then the insurance is like, no, we don't wanna cover your MRI. And I'm like, what? They're like, we don't think it's important. So I finally wait like, hold They're like, like, we know like, that you're not in pain. Hey. Yeah, so we maybe waited like two months for like to appeal it from the insurance and the insurance finally let me get it but they let me get it as in like they basically let me get it and they're like you don't need this but we're gonna let you get it this one time and i'm like rude how do they know i don't need it how do they know that this isn't important or like good for my health or something they just thought it's like recreational or yeah so i don't know but i finally was able to get my mri i got it last week so it'll be interesting to find out officially what's wrong i think it has something to do with my tendons right here i'm sure it's not that big of a deal but it definitely sucks you know i feel like i have a lot of like we like re <laughs> weak Weak, weak wrist. wrist. Weak wrist because of it. So, anyways, I don't know. Let's jump into the day, guys. Well, so do you want to tell them about your new shades that you got? Uh, yeah, new shades. Who this? <laughs> That's how it goes, right? Nah. Carlos and I got some new shades, which I just like them because when I put it up my hair now, it doesn't get stuck in my hair. Because, like, you know those, those, those different ones that have, like, the things that stick out? Yeah, those ones, they get caught in your hair. Now I can put it up in my hair, and it's no big deal. What a whole new world for me. Carlos, I got some new ones, too see yours though they're so similar to your last ones they just aren't uh, mirrored anymore like his were his old ones these were these ones they have like a reflection that you can like see yourself but now he has ones that don't do that i mean well, other than that they though, don't i, mean, other than I think that, they still do barely though it's a different type of though i joked with the nurse that there was a scar in my hand and she didn't think it was funny i'm at the doctor office though now i'll keep you guys updated let you freaking out because she didn't think my joke was funny i should have just i should have just answered normally i feel so stupid now All right, sweetie, it didn't sound like good news. You didn't seem too it happy when, like, when you walked out of there. You were like kind of sad. I don't know what I was expecting to hear, I guess. Um, I mean, they, they basically told me what I already knew. I mean, they confirmed what they thought the problem was. It's the Aquarian tenosynovitis. 
Do you know what that means? It basically means my tendons right here suck. <laughs> That's basically what it means. There's not really much more to say about so, it. What did they say they could do to well, fix it? What really put me off was that he just walked in. He's like, yep, it's what we thought it was. I'm like, okay, yeah, I already knew that. And he's like, so you want to do surgery? That's what he said. Like, so you want to do surgery? And I'm like, just straight to surgery? Yeah, just went straight to surgery. Literally, the first thing he said was like, so do you want to set up surgery? And I was like, what? And he goes, yeah, so basically we would, you know, like cut a hole right here and we're going to poke into your tendon. We're going to poke a hole in it and relieve your pain. And I was like, he's like, anyway, so um, which wrist do you want to do first? I'm like, I don't know if I want to do this yet. I was like, uh, I mean, no, I don't want to do surgery. Nobody wants to do surgery. No one's like, yeah, surgery. No one wants to do surgery. So like, the first thing was like, well, like, there's nothing else I should do. He's like, I mean, you could put topicals and, you know, you could wear splints or whatever, you know, and you could do all these things and I'm like well I'll, I'll try topicals but I guess he didn't hear me when I said topicals so then he started asking me like so which wrist do you want to do first and I'm like what I'm like I guess the right and he goes yeah because we can't have both wrists out at once and I'm like wait what do you mean oh yeah because you I think you won't be able to do yeah. much with that yeah so like he, they, they won't do two wrists at once just like they won't do like two leg surgeries probably because then you'll completely be feeding yeah. you for like yeah. how many weeks <laughs> he's like even though you have a spouse we do one at a time but I, I was confused because I, I thought I said I wasn't sure yet but he took it as we're doing it. So then he started like writing all these things down. Like, so you're gonna get a call, you're gonna have like 30 days. And I'm like, for topicals? And he goes, no, for surgery. I'm like, I'm gonna <laughs> do topicals for now. I'm gonna think about surgery. I don't know if I'm ready to commit to surgery in both my wrists. All right, where did they say they wanted to cut you open? Basically, we'll see where my cortisone shot was. It's basically right next to, I think it's like right here. They slice this open. They pry it open, and I think he said they poke a hole through my tendons to relieve the pain, basically. And I, um, when I first said it, I said I want to do my right hand first, because I think my right hand is worse, and then they would do my left. It's not that big of a deal. Surgery, I think. How long did they say was the recovery? I didn't ask, because did I was confused by why he kept talking about the surgery when oh, I said okay. I wasn't sure yet. I don't know. I got these just topicals. I hate topicals. So I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Uh, I'm going to try these topicals, I guess, and see how it goes. Um, it's the Quervain's tenosynovitis. <laughs> Look it up. It's basically tendon swelling. Look it up, but do you know how to spell it? <laughs> I know how to spell it now because I was Googling it while he was when he, when he left me in the room. I was like, the Quervain's tenosynovitis. <laughs> I was like looking at it all up like a weirdo. If these are even gonna work, he said they might work, but he didn't really seem too hopeful. Do you think we should go to another doctor and get a second opinion? I think they messed up on the MRI. I think they heard on the outside they were talking. Uh, so this is my MRI on my CD right here. And when they were out there talking, they were saying that there was four images of the same wrist, but that it didn't matter because they they got what they needed. But I feel like the MRI people didn't put all the pictures on here maybe. So, I mean, I think they got the diagnosis from the one picture they got, but I don't think they had all the pictures they needed. But they didn't tell me that. I just heard them talking about it, and then he walked in saying it doesn't matter. Oh, wow. Because you think he, he already knows what it is. I mean, the whole the whole thing about... The, the easiest way to diagnose this is you put your thumb in like this, and you bend your wrist down. I yeah, won't I, I do, could it. do it. I could do it. I, could do it. I so won't do it because right? it makes me cry. Yeah, is it it's just that. this? Just yeah. this movement? It's this oh. movement, and it causes... Basically, really horrible pain right here. I won't even do it because it literally it hurts so bad to do it. Okay, but it's good that thing. movement. Your I tendons have... are fine. What do you think I'm doing now? Do you know what the problem is? This is what you've been waiting for. I know. For I'm, years. I'm happy that I got a diagnosis. <laughs> we'll see you in the future, guys. Yeah. All right. We just got back from the Goodwill. We uh, ended up donating some stuff there. And we're at the yeah. gym now. I'm actually not going to work out because yeah. I'm going to lay off my wrist. Your wrist. So sad. Look at that. Also, like. No more kickboxing for no you. Sorry. Kickboxing. I can still kick. No, nah, but my ankle can bother me today. And also, like, my back. You know what you can still do? I'm just broken. You can still do core. No, that, that would hurt my back. <laughs> Everything would hurt if I. No, nah, I'm just kidding. I'll probably do something because I don't want to be lazy. But. You go running then, right? Oh, heck oh, no. no. I went running yesterday. I ain't running again. <laughs> oh, yeah. That was fun. Well, leave in the comments. Does anybody like running? I took a poll on my on my, uh, on my my Instagram a couple days ago. About 80% of people said they don't like running. What? So I just found this little 20 percenter here who likes running. I don't like running. I just... I feel good after that. Nah, one. I hate running. I'm just going to take the MMA class and Cass is going to do some core. Yeah. And then uh, I'll drive home. Make sure you guys stay tuned for our Monday video because we're going to take Coda on a special little trip. So keep an eye on that. If it's already out, on that link in the iCard. And with that, we'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.